Hi, I'm Nancy Thompson, the Eight Weeks to Wellness Director at the Springfield Wellness Center. It's that time of year where my fitness visits are low because I have so many people on vacation. It's summertime, I have lots of people uh, on vacation and a lot of them have asked me before they leave, you know, what can I do? Do I need to go to the gym while I'm on my trip? Um, they're concerned about losing, their, losing a bit of fitness and you really don't need to be concerned about that if you're gonna be gone for just a week or two. In fact, if you ask me, I mean, a vacation is a time to get away from the routine. So um, I encourage people though to stay active certainly and to follow a few other words of advice regarding their overall health and wellness while you're taking that vacation. Certainly the first one again regarding fitness is stay active. Um, uh, if you're like me, most of my vacations are actually pretty active. I probably need to work harder finding more rest and relaxation, but, but for some people maybe they're going to be traveling or sitting a lot and your mode of transportation is going to keep you you know, in a, in a certain uh, um, uh, sedentary position. So it would be really good to plan for movement. So whether it's in the uh, airport or train terminal or wherever it is you're having to, to um, stay uh, sedentary, maybe make plans to get up, move around, use the um, uh, space you do have to move at least every 30 to 45 minutes while you're traveling. And then while you're actually on vacation, certainly make sure you're, t just like you would maybe while you're home, take the stairs, uh, walk to where you're going to eat perhaps, um, build activity into your trip. You don't necessarily need to have a workout every day because that, again, is something you're doing at home and maybe you want to break out of that routine and I think that would be great. So um, just build activity into your trip. Um, but then you can also build exercises into maybe before you start your day at, in the hotel, there's exercises we can do. I and mean, there's like three nice solid exercises that will help you maintain your fitness while you're away on your trip that um, I'm gonna demonstrate. Uh, secondly, the thing to, that really trips people up, of course, is food and what you're consuming. Try to keep it simple. Certainly enjoy the food that's maybe the local favorites. Um, if you, there's indulgences or those um, high fat or high sugary treats that you want to enjoy, please do so, but do so in more of a sample size and, and not maybe the uh, super size. Um, you can still enjoy the local flavors without um, going hog wild and maybe even enjoy more fruit, fresh fruits and vegetables of the location of where you're traveling to. And thirdly, build in rest and relaxation. So many people try to pack so much into their trip that they actually come back more fatigued than when they left. So take some time maybe in the morning and in the, at the end of your busy day to take some time for meditation or reflection and maybe uh, consider what you're thankful for on your trip or what um, was good and healthy about your day and reflect on that, take some time to rest, and then when you do return, you'll still maintain that wonderful level of health and fitness that you've been working towards. This is Nancy Thompson, your eight weeks to wellness director at the Springfield Wellness Center.